beautiful kids. Today I'm going to make a pinch pot. And I have a few different samples of pinch pots that my, some of my students have made. Um, so this one is kind of a fancy one with a top and a bottom um, and some handles on the side and carved. This one is a more basic one, more smooth, a little bit deeper, um, but still kind of with an edge on the top. And then this one, this is a one that we made a while ago. So this is like a little fish bowl. Um, made a basic pinch pot and created a little fish to go inside. So let's start with our pinch pot. So we're gonna create a little ball out of our clay. So we're going to, sometimes it might already be a ball, sometimes it might be a slab, but we're going to roll it into a ball. So you can roll it with your hand, you can tap it a little bit like this, and that helps to get some of the air bubbles out. You can roll it around, use your hands, but try all these different things. We're just gonna get a nice, smooth ball. That is step number one. All right, we've got our nice ball now. So we're gonna start with our bowl. And the first step is to take our thumb and just push right down into the middle of our ball. Create that indention right there. And then we're gonna take our fingers and kind of like a, a duck bill, we're going to um, pinch and pull. Pinch and pull and push down at the same time. We don't want to pull it out too far. We want to keep it nice and controlled. Um, but if you want a deeper bowl, then you're going to push down farther. If you want a shallower bowl, then you'll just pull out a little bit more. But you don't want to pull too much. Um, yep, so you're just going to keep going like that. You don't want to pull it out too hard. You want your the lip of your bowl right there to be nice and nice and secure okay nice and smooth if it starts getting too thin or if it starts getting uneven you can turn it over like this tap it down a little bit that helps to get your your lid um, of your or the top part of your bowl nice and even and smooth as you go along smoothing is a really important step smoothing it as you go All right, and you're just gonna keep working on your bowl till you're happy with it. Remember, the most important thing is not to pull it out too far. You don't want the edge of your bowl to get cracky or really thin. It's gotta be nice and chunky. Remember, things need to be at least the, the thickness of your pinky finger, okay? Anything too thin than that is, um, is in danger of cracking or breaking off. All right, so we're just gonna keep smoothing our bowl. This is a very important step, smoothing, smoothing. I'm using some of my slip here. You can't see it in the video, but it's the little water, the clay mud um, that I use to smooth everything out a lot. Remember, just one finger dip at a time. You don't take a whole handful. You just take one finger dip at a time with the water. You don't wanna end up with muddy muddy hands so just one finger at a time all right and you're just going to keep working with that all right and when you feel like you're happy with your bowl check it over really well see if there's any last minute smoothing you need to do anything else you need to do now if you want to decorate your bowl you can certainly do that with adding some designs or carvings that always looks really nice um, but if you are happy with it, if you're not gonna add any other designs, remember to carve your initials or your name in the bottom, nice and clear so we can read it. And that's it. So I hope you enjoy making your clay bowl today. All right, have fun.